Alright, what's in with the gang members? We right back. Um, this time we're gonna be checking out why you don't check or why you don't guard stuff this week. Um, basically they talk about um, single uh, man, you know, man to man uh, defense on um, stuff. Why that's a, a, a no go, basically. Um, obviously, like, you know, you're a sniper from any range, like anywhere on the court, so that's already understood. But um, I'm pretty sure that they about to give us some details or something like that. It's going to be all based on um, game four of the uh, 2022 finals, which is going on right now. They just know one game, five tonight. But the uh, analysis of this video is based on that. Um, either way, we about to be checking it out. Um, y'all make sure y'all subscribe to the channel if y'all ain't already subscribed. Um, like the video, comment, let me know something. Um, let's check it out. After four scintillating games of... Hold on, hold on. Good job from the beginning. After four scintillating games of the 2022 finals, uh -huh. Steph Curry is averaging 34 points a night Basically, on smoking hot 66% true shooting, by far his highest miss, scoring volume in any of the 26 me. playoff series he's played in his career. And while he's added... I'm trying to get ahead to the part where they're actually showing it on. The game four. Uh, game three. Come here, bro. I'll time it at least load up. On the offensive end in this game, the limitations we discussed in game three were. Come on now. more aggression from him on the offensive end in this game the limitations we discussed in game three were still an issue for the golden state offense with the celtics able to roam off him and essentially ignore him out on the perimeter so steve kerr in an incredibly bold move sent draymond to the bench and he immediately reaped the benefits of having all those shooters out Drawing there pool. as Clay drives Clay. into a ton of space and turns for a great look to cut it to three. The Celtics try to put Curry in screening okay. action, and Wiggins wants to fight over this screen so Steph can avoid the switch, but Tatum brilliantly cuts back door. Ooh, Thompson sees this instantly this. and makes an incredible save at the rim. Nice With Tatum behind the play, it's a five on four. That forces Boston center to pick up Clay in transition, and in a small ball lineup, that means no big men left in the paint, so Wiggins can use his size and athleticism to score on the I ain't got nothing to do with stuff. Andrew was huge in this game, grabbing 11 of his This possession was a clinic, with Wiggins containing him in space, then he's strong enough to avoid a back down, and on the reset completely shuts him off again. He also had a few nice help possessions, switching off Tatum here, then lingering in the lane and steering him into a tough fadeaway oh, yeah, with nothing nice. else open. A few minutes later, with the lead still at two, the Celtics' late game offense stagnated again. This plagued them during the Miami series. So Jalen tries to drive into Clay, only that one rims out, and Curry yeah, grabs the rebound and pushes it down the court. He's left on Curry Island, and that's not where you want to rob in screening action. And after Smart is into that open space for an open three oh, and the part I want. Let's convert. Let me get back to step. Urge on him in transition, so he drags them all to the left side of the floor while Clay runs into that open space for an open three and the yes. lead. After a Brown miss, Curry tries to attack Raw for the three draw, uh, and the lead. All to the bit. left side of the floor, oh, yeah, while Clay did. runs into that he open space did. for an open three and the lead. After a Brown miss, Curry tries to attack Rob in screening action, and after Smart Ooh. falls down, he's left on Curry Island, and Wait, that's that not where you want to be. 
This mismatch hunting has defined the series for Curry, consistently attacking Boston's big men in pick and roll, and the Celtics do not want their centers dancing outside the staff. Most teams around the league don't drop their big men against Curry because of his shooting. And historically, all of Steph's yeah, finals opponents have trapped him in a, um, some form to get the ball out. If you want to take it. Up their big men against Curry because of his shooting. And like right there. That could have been to the um, that could have been the alley. And historically, all of Steph's finals opponents have trapped him in some form to get the ball out of his hands and pick and roll and force his teammates to beat them. The Cavs didn't always blitz him, but they did have their bigs up at the screen to take away Curry's pull-up shooting, then stay with him until he passed. Sometimes they would also switch a more mobile big man on him and then recover as needed to help, basically anything to take away his pull-up three. But the Celtics have played a drop coverage with their big man throughout the series, and this just gives Curry way too much airspace to fire within his sweet spots. Notice how Rob Williams is inside the three-point line, and even when he doesn't take a three, it's an uncontested jumper in rhythm. Boss.